All right, we've got another interesting integral from MIT here. On this one, it was kind of strange. I really just used luck on it. I didn't know what I was doing, but I found a way. What I was noticing was, it seems like product rule could be a possibility. When we have plus or minus, I mean, you could split it into two integrals, or you might think of it as product rule. When I did that, I created a variable f, or I set this piece right here equal to f. Of course, it's not really clear how it's gonna work. I mean, this can be broken into two pieces, but this can't really. I mean, you could create a one here, but it doesn't really make sense. Anyway, I just did it. So we take a derivative on it. What's gonna happen first with e as the base, we get back this. Then with chain rule, we need to differentiate this. So what we get back is e to the x minus one. You could put a dx, but let's leave it. But now if I distribute this back out, multiply it in, when you multiply this times e to the x, you get minus x plus x, those cancel out and we get just e to the e to the x. And then multiplying to minus one, you get minus e to the e to the x minus x. But what just happened is this f prime value is the whole thing. This is the same thing as all of this. So we actually, act so accidentally I found the antiderivative, the integral of this thing is gonna be just this. So we can go backwards and say this integral is gonna be e to the e to the x minus x evaluated from zero to one. Plug in, we'll do it carefully. First plug in a one and we get e to the e to the one minus one and then minus plug in a zero. e to the zero is one minus zero, and then I'll just clean it up. What we're left with for the solution on this is gonna be just e to the e minus one minus e, and that's it. Okay, so there you go, kind of a lucky break, just guessing at the right thing to choose. If you wanted to do it out more carefully, integration by parts will work here. You could, it works better if you do a u substitution, but you could kind of break it up, just integrate one of these. I think it's better, it seemed like maybe a good idea to integrate this one. I don't know, maybe that works too, but integrating this with integration by parts, you're gonna get back something to cancel with this other side. So I think that's gonna work out pretty nice too. All right, there you go, that's it for today. Thanks everyone for watching, have a good day.